Got the blue truck around back. Of course, there's the other junk. I see his crap here, and we got a lot of flooding in the yard because all the snow's melting. Like I, like I said to you guys, we got four warnings. We got wind advisory, winter weather advisory, uh, flooding, and all that other kind of stuff. But you see, the blue truck outside's a lot cleaner. It's not that good. We took it through Hutch car wash. But the one we were going to take it through, they were working on it. But when we got, as soon as we got home, I pulled it back here. Spent about like two, uh, one and a half to two hours just vacuuming the grass out. Of course, the dash isn't done because I don't have any stuff. And plus, it's getting late anyway. So. Yeah, it's not perfect. Nowhere near. Because the vacuum we got, the hose is too big to get in the tight spaces. But it's definitely uh, better. Uh, driver's side looks pretty decent. See, I slid. Look at all that. That's mo that's all ice right there. Right. And passenger side's dirtier, but way better. You can see the paint a lot better. A lot more shine. Yep, this cab corner is definitely bubbling up. But my dad's going. We're going to be getting a flatbed for this. And get the cab corners fixed and everything. This truck's gonna look nice, but it's definitely a lot better, you guys can see in the inside. But yeah, as you can see, it's not perfect. But I got inside the doors the best I could, but I told my dad that we're gonna have to uh we're gonna have to like Whatever you call it. Oh, get that plugged in. We're going to have to go over some spots. Touch some spots up. That's what I was looking for. We have to touch some spots up. So we can get a little hose and get to the hard to reach places. So, but other than that, that's it. That and the dash and truck will be good to go. See, it was around that area. I was backing up because I was getting a little close to the yard. But as soon as I backed up and barely gave it gas, the tire just spun. So I was like, I'll just go forward the whole time. That's how icy it is. Look at this. It's like 51 degrees out, I think. It's, it feels like it's getting warmer. It's supposed to be getting warmer all night. Then tomorrow, the temperature's supposed to go down all day. 53 at 1 in the morning. But found this laying there. Since my dad's business partner has a Suzuki. Give that to him. There we are. Copy written. Okay. Guess I'll roll this down. Get a little bit better here. The truck. You see how icy it is. Yeah, see, I can feel my back tires sleeping a little bit. I'm gonna go slow so I don't splatter crap everywhere. I can feel my rear tires like right now. Yeah. Look at that. I'm not even tapping the gas right now. Let's just try, see if four-wheel drive will help that. Hang it back there. Guys, I'm not even on the gas right now. Still not on the gas. It's icy. <laughs> I can feel the rear end a little bit. A little slow here.
turn this thing around. Freaking icy, I'll tell you that. See if I can make it up the hill without sliding. Alright. Put that in. Dang it. got her. Yeah, look at that. That's a deer. Like splashing stuff on stuff that just got cleaned. My dad washed this, washed the green truck, so he had it out today. I'm not tapping the gas. Up, oh, tires are spinning. Not tapping the gas, so let's see if we'll go creep up this hill without tapping. Oh yeah, no problem. It does look a little low for some reason. Back it up a little bit. Good enough. Sweet.